maximizing the acceleration of a dragster is all about increasing the force of friction between the tires and the road. So immediately before the race, the drivers burn out a slick, heating up the tires and leaving a trail of hot rubber on the ground. And so we have hot rubber on hot rubber. Then they back over the slick, and you can see here cleaning off the tires meticulously, and then race over that same mark. So this is how we maximize the coefficient of friction. But friction is more. It's also the normal force. And this is how we can increase the normal force. If the exhaust of the pipes is turned upward and expelled at high velocity, you have essentially a rocket engine driving the car into the ground. And we can see this very nicely at night when the added fuel emissions are visible. The thrust forcing the exhaust upward is equal and opposite to the thrust pushing the car downward. And so now we have an increased downward force, but the vehicle is itself in equilibrium in the vertical direction. So that increased downward force increases the normal force between the car and the wheels. We can see this clearly in the slow motion as this car takes off. As soon as the engine revs to maximum power, we can see the car be pushed down by the vertical emissions of the exhaust increasing the normal force, increasing the friction, increasing the acceleration.